So the responsibilities of a video engineer on the Nautilus are a few things, actually. It's more than just camera work. Um, you obviously are responsible for the cameras that look out at the deck and what's going on with ROV operations. Um, you have control over cameras in the wet lab, in the ROV hangar. You have control of the cameras um, that are inside the control van as well. And then you are responsible for getting that footage out to the audiences. There's also a map of our location. So channel one, two, and quad. And Sarah's taking us on a tour of the van right now. If you're in the quad channel, say hi, back row. Hello. <laughs> That's our science row. And then you're also responsible for communications between team members in the control van. So you have what's called an RTS panel, and it's basically this big key panel that you plug your headphone into, and you can decide who you want to talk to or listen to. Um, so we're responsible for making sure that works and is set up correctly. We're responsible for recording all footage from the dives, um, and we're responsible for making sure all the cameras on the ROVs um, are zoomed in, color corrected properly, uh, focused. Uh, we're basically the eyes and ears of the ROV pilots and the team that's in the control van. Video, can I get a zoom? Sure. It's just like a bunch of stuff growing on there. There's a broadcast video engineer position who, using these controls, controls the cameras on both Argus and Hercules. There's 12 cameras total on the ROVs, and there's 11 cameras on the vessels, so 23 total cameras that this position is responsible for, in addition to monitoring all the communications on board the vessel, communication between the control van and the bridge. This position has a lot going on, but it's critical because this is where we get all of our deliverables from. It's a, a great learning experience if you're going into the video engineer um, track. When I came out here for mobilization, I spent a lot of time installing cameras and routing cameras and monitors and stuff like that. Stuff I didn't get a chance to do while in school. Normally they don't trust students enough to do it, so I got a lot of first-hand experience on the boat. gotten this much experience in live broadcasting. The Nautilus sends out um, live feeds through satellites back to shore and it's just been amazing to see how that works in real time and yeah, get to experience it and learn how it's all done. I think it's, uh, if you want to be in the video engineering side or videography side, it's, it's most valuable. You know, you're, you're out on a research vessel 200 miles away from land looking at things that people have never seen that looks like it's on an alien planet. And you're the one who is getting the footage. And that's just super cool. Um, from my time aboard the Nautilus, I've gained so much valuable experience in shooting, photography, working with different people, you know. Definitely I would recommend it if you want to see the world, if you enjoy videography, if you want to see things that people have never seen, if you just want to enjoy life and experience things you've never experienced before, I would definitely suggest it.